Welcome back. We are here now on the Friday of Decision. Boy, I tell you what, when it comes to business, you're going to have to make lots of decisions. Today is a big one for how we're going to progress because I have learned a lot, a lot. Welcome back. We are the Playing Adventure Capitalists. I'm Big Daddy here on Hop Gaming, and we were away for 23 hours and 18 minutes. And as you can see, 35.08 quadrillion dollars. Pretty good chunk of change. Now, the real question, I saw a lot of people saying, oh, you're going to have 18 quadrillion, 15 quadrillion, 20. You know, a lot of people were talking about that, but... The real guesses have been how many angels would we have? Because there is a orange circle lit up, I know we have more than 277 ready to come on board. That lights up as soon as you're able to double your investors. So that that's why that's lit. The real question is, are we going to break a thousand? And then what decision are we really going to make? Because it just may not be uh, completely viable to restart now and just wait and still do a restart on Friday depending on how many angels. And uh, I'll kind of explain why once we see. But some of the guesses we've seen, uh, I've seen some guess 1100, some 1200. Uh, I personally think that uh, we're going to be somewhere around 1100 as well, 10,000 to 1100. I think we barely crossed the... Uh, I think my guess was we were going to get 500 and something angels over the course of the 23 hours just from the oil fields. Um, and then we were going to get another three or 400 from the banks and it's just going to go from there. So did we break a thousand angels ready to come on? Well, we're going to find out. Let's look. And three, two, one. Wait for that one. Okay. Boom. No, we did not. Wow. Now, we would have exactly 1,000 if we claimed them right now. 723 ready to come on board. Um, what I have learned is it's based on your career, okay? Your career earnings, so from the restart. So I don't remember what my career earnings were when I reset last month on Monday, a few days ago. Um, but that's what it goes by. Whatever your career earnings were at the restart, then it's some sort of algorithm by X amount of billion dollars for one angel or percentage or something like that. And I can't really explain it because it's a whole algorithm type thing. But... Um, I've noticed that, you know, you're not going to get any real angels until you've got at least 50 of everything to where it can turn around and put a bunch of money in your pocket. Okay, so now, where does that leave us? Well, it leaves us with 35.278 quadrillion to spend as we try and figure out how we're going to leave ourselves for the weekend because it is obvious we're not going to restart with only 723 angels. Well, yeah, still 723. So 6.9 trillion just cashed over and it still didn't give us another angel. So that tells you it's going to, it may be harder to give them than we thought. So let's look at what we can do max wise. Um, I mean, we can get, we can get donuts to 200. We may or may not be able to get uh, shrimp and hockey up close to 200. Uh, and that would be nice because they would all be chugging along a lot faster over the weekend. However, there's some other things we can do. We can just add a straight 100 to the lemons, but that's still not going to really get us anywhere. Or we can look at the upgrades. Now, here's what's interesting about these upgrades. That one right there. Oil company profit times three for 20 quadrillion. Now, 20 quadrillion would give us more than 530, no, 520 
trillion dollars every nine and a half minutes. That would be more than three quadrillion an hour for the whole weekend. Folks, I'm telling you, we're going to end up with more than a quintillion dollars. We're going to have probably multiple quintillion dollars on Monday. And we'll have probably 1,500 to 2,000 angels. The decision has to be made, though. Which way are we going to go? I could triple, straight up triple both the banks and the oil companies right now. Still have five quadrillion left over. Triple both of them up. And that would take the banks to over 20 trillion every minute and a half. That's still a lot of money. So I definitely want to do this one. Because now we're getting $523.89 trillion per. Then, as you can see, I can still buy 50 of them. Now, I did that for a reason. I wanted to make sure we were maxing out $785.835 trillion every nine and a half minutes. Now you're talking more than 4.3 quadrillion an hour from just your oil fields. So now we're pretty much guaranteed to have 300, 400 quadrillion over this long weekend just from the oil fields. What else can we bump up? Well, hmm. Okay. Okay. Up to 50, yeah. All right. So now everything is 150 or higher. I like that. Um, now, I, you know, I can't, uh, I actually can't raise the donuts up to 200. I'd love to be able to raise the donuts up to 200, but I can't. But what I can do is I can either triple up the donuts or the shrimp. The shrimp are a pretty good spot to triple up because it would actually take them up and over 16 billion a second for the whole weekend. That's not bad. Taint bad at all. So you gotta like that. And I don't think we're gonna be able to stretch it much further than that. So, I mean, there's no angels, nothing else. You know, we're still sitting there. So we can do one of two things. We can bump 10 on every single one of those that has, that has uh, 150, the first four of them. Donuts, shrimp, hockey, and movies. And we could add 10 more and make them all 160 going into the weekend. Doesn't sound like a bad idea. As the movie theaters, quite frankly, it would bump it up over 800, probably up close to 815, 820 billion every 20 seconds. It's not a bad idea. So I don't know. Decisions, decisions. Kind of disappointed when I get to do the angel investors. But I said I'd only do it if I had a thousand to add what I had, not a thousand total. So we definitely are going to be just adding angels all weekend. And that's not a bad thing. Let's, um, golly, let's just add. Yeah. There it is. We bumped donuts up to 180. I mean, I think in the end, just adding to what we have is better. So this is where we're gonna be at. Not too shabby. Um, I'm not unhappy about this at all. I mean, we got quite a bit of money now chugging. 
And again, in 10 seconds, we're going to get another 785.8 trillion from our oil fields. And that's going to allow us to at least, at least buy either 10 hockey or 10 shrimp. I think you could actually buy, no. Okay, we're just going to buy the 10 hockey. Boom! 74.6 billion every five seconds. Not bad. All right, so this weekend, we're not going to come back again until Monday. Where are we going to be at on Monday? I mean, we've got a solid, solid foundation built from yesterday. We know we've got 700 angels already ready to come on board on Monday, and we're going to have 72 hours of nothing but profitability. Where are we going to end up? Where do you think we'll finish? How much money do you think we're going to make? Well, and how many angels? How many angels are we going to be able to add? Here's my guess. Because I can look it out. It looks like we're getting nine or ten angels every time now that that oil field resets. Which means we're going to get about 60 angels an hour just from that. I don't know, something like that. Maybe I'm overestimating. I mean, my guess is we're going to end up with about 3,000, maybe 3,500 angels to add on Monday when we restart. And that is going to be a gigantic explosion in profits. How much money are we going to have to start with? Huh, I'm going to say somewhere around a quintillion, maybe 1.5 quintillion. Can we reach that next plateau? I don't know. But the decision making that we have now has set us up with some really, really good profit margins for the weekend. And we'll see how it plays out. I'll see you after the weekend on Monday here on Adventure Capitalist and Hop Gaming. Have a great weekend and go make some money. Take care.